Eight months of racing comes down to Saturday at Toledo Speedway. Track championships and the Arkham Menard Series title at stake. Nick Sanchez and Daniel Dye separated by just two points for the Arca crown. Many of racing's greats have called Arca home on their way up. And the series calls Toledo home. So this is always a special trip for drivers. The Short Lunch 200 is also the season finale for the first time since 2011 when Ty Dillon won the championship. So the enthusiasm is ramped up, even if you're not in the fight. Waterford, Michigan's Amber Slagle making the jump to stock cars here, but the track's reputation is the same across the board. Uh, with all the history that's there for ARCA and, and Toledo and, you know, the track in general, that's cool. And I think the publicity they've done for it and for this race has been really good, too. It's a very racy racetrack. Um, it's very competitive, and that could be one thing that, that makes it an exciting event. You know, it's not a one-groove racetrack. You can kind of move around a little bit, and it just it makes it more exciting for us as drivers to, to have that ability. You know, for me, I like being able to, to move around and be able to race your competitors hard. So. We've had this one plan for a little while because I knew like I just wanted the chance to be able to race close to home again, race in front of my friends and all my family. And um, I've been doing a lot of West races and that's hard for, you know, friends and family to come to. So usually they all watch it on TV, but now to be able to have a huge fan base and, um, you know, all my family there supporting me again, is going to be awesome. Even though I'm not one that's, you know, competing for that championship title, we're all still there to win a race. Advanced tickets are available for $10 off through Friday at Northwest Ohio and Southeast Michigan Menard stores. Green flag for the ARCA race is Saturday at 4.